It's been a very, very busy day, uh, probably one of the, the more busy days we've ever had around here. We've had literally hundreds and hundreds of phone calls from across the country, even across uh, the ocean. Um, so we've been trying to field all those. We've had a lot of uh, family here, a lot of friends, a lot of supporters, and a lot of fans who are curious about what's going on. The latest is he still re he remains in critical condition, which was his condition when he arrived here at UMC. I've been told uh, this evening that he is scheduled for some additional surgery, which is not unusual when you have uh, injuries that are this severe. So we're planning on taking him to back to surgery sometime this evening. Is there a problem we hear with his lung? Is that something that is questionable? Thing? Well, he has he has numerous injuries. He has multiple gunshot wounds to the chest, and so yes, that's always a possibility that a lung could be hit, a lung could collapse, or there could be other internal injuries that might need additional attention in the OR. Any uh, you were talking about different stages here at UMC of, of uh, ratings, can you elaborate on critical? Well, he he's in he's in critical condition, and to explain that, we have. Um, several different categories how we classify patients starting with good fair serious and critical so he is critically he is critically injured he is in the trauma intensive care unit which is the most intensive care we offer in this institution is he, uh, can he sit up and talk? Sitting up and talking? no he is not sorry he, he is he is not sitting up and he is not talking Probably he was dead. Is yes he is he is unconscious yes there's been a number of visitors including jesse jackson and I, other people that you can i i missed uh, jesse jackson i understand that he was here today we had expected a visit from mike tyson as well but i guess he did not uh, materialize and uh don king, don king uh, we had heard that don king was coming but i don't think he he was here he came either uh, jesse jackson is the only celebrity that I know of that, uh, that's just come so far. What are you doing for the people's friends and fans in here? Well, we're just trying to accommodate. Our, our, our first concern is the patient. Our second concern is the family. So we're trying to uh, obviously keep them abreast of what's going on and offer them the, the same comfort and support we would offer any trauma patient that comes here to UMC. Can you set up a special recording? Yes, we do. We do have a recording line for, for everyone in the media and other people who are inquiring that come through the uh, they come through our switchboard so we can immediately transfer people over to that line and it's being updated as things change. Have you received a lot of calls? We've yeah, literally had hundreds and hundreds of, of phone calls. I've been here since early this morning in and out and uh, our switchboard is uh, is literally going nuts, yes. Any idea if it's should I return back to the day? I'm sorry? Should I should I return to the time today? Have you talked to him about the other guy? Mr. Knight, Marion? Yeah. yeah. Um, I have not. He was discharged this morning at about um, about 11 o'clock, and he just had a minor injury to the to the head. Was he, did he visit with Tupac early this morning? Yes, he did come down and, and visit the uh, the trauma ICU. He sure did, yes. What floor is that? First floor. First trauma ICU? Yes. 